My account is a city that's been growing quite a bit. I came here about six or seven years ago, and, and since that time, it's, it's really grown significantly. We are an environment of, of patients that are more engaged in, in their medical care. It's part of the culture, so I think we have to adapt to that. The uh, main uh, industry is healthcare, and I think that's uh, where this community is going. Well, there's a need in the valley. I like electronics, I like modern, and uh, my patients do too. Uh, they're, they're excited about having uh, an EMR at the office. You don't need to be a high-tech guy uh, to work uh, in the EMR. You just want to get organized. Everybody should have an EMR system. In order for, honestly, I'm not a physician, I'm not a provider, but it helps them provide best quality care for the patient. I truly believe that. The FDA banned the use of Darvaset. We went ahead and asked Cerner if we could use the system to give us a list of all the patients that were on Darvaset. And it didn't take very long, five, 10 minutes. We got the list. Before, if you had your paper chart, it would be almost impossible to do it. So my EMR came in and, and saved my height. It also checks drug interactions. It'll notify you there's a problem and you can change it right then and there. It takes a lot of time for us to call pharmacies and get the information if they don't bring the medications with them. Here we can just look it up, you know exactly how much they're taking, how frequently, what medications that they're taking. We'll avoid duplications in tests. We'll be able to avoid duplications in medications, uh, lab tests. We are more efficient. Uh, we haven't hired anybody else, so we are managed 20% more volume with the same uh, personnel. A lot of doctors that have not come in touch with uh, medical records, in particular with Cerner, might think that it's too complicated. And I can understand why, because when you get a new medical record, it's like learning how to use a new tool. It always takes a little bit of effort to learn how to do it. But Cerner is very, very user-friendly to the point that it's intuitive how to do things. It's been a little over 25 years and I was accustomed to paper charts. I had never touched an electronic record, and I was very lucky because Dr. Arginal already knew about the system, and he was very good at it. And in two or three days, he taught me the system, so I'm doing it. Some physicians are still determined to handwrite their notes, even though they, you can't understand them. We all failed handwriting classes. You know, we're not very good at it. In paper, uh, it's very easy to under-document, sometimes just jot a little scribble and uh, pretend that that says actually something that is intelligible. The documentation ends up being a lot better for the patient care. That way, if my colleagues come in behind me and try to figure out what I did the day before, it's clearly documented in the chart. If a patient asks the physician or the provider any kind of question, it's there. I mean. He doesn't have to be flipping through pages because those are interfaced through the system. You can do pre-completed notes, so it makes my work a lot faster. It has a learning curve, no questions about it, but at the end it's going to be in the benefit of the patient. If there is a technology out there that's going to reach that goal, why not use it? Cerner has been taking the lead on uh, electronic health record, not only in offices, but also in the hospitals. We proved that it can be done, and we're not that special. I mean, we just a bunch of guys in South Texas. How special can we be?